I'm trying to get my hands on some quick sets. Here he is. New tool time. Because I just went and bought a new tool uh, to put in my EDC bag. Uh, so I ended up getting the Stanley Fat Max. So I was looking at a couple of the screwdrivers they had at Bunnings. Um, I wanted something small, compact, that would fit in my ADC bag. Nothing massive. I do carry the multi-tool with screwdrivers on it. Um, this one we've all seen because I've talked about it. And it does work for a lot of things. Uh, but some of the stuff that I come across, you know, I can't quite fit this in. It's quite not quite deep enough to go in to do up the screws. Uh, that I need to. I mean, it does work for a lot of things, but a lot also it doesn't reach into the actual area to, well, into the holes where the screws are. So it takes a little bit more work to get it to fit in. So I ended up wanting to buy something that, you know, wouldn't, would be able to fit in there and the small and compact had quite a few features in it anyway. Um, so let's cut this open and we'll have a look. We'll see what it's like. It's any good. So it's like $23 I picked that up for. So I think it was on sale. And that'll do. So, what are we going to need? Six pieces, stubby, multi bit ratcheting screwdriver. Um, nine degree, fine, 45 tooth ratchet, magnetic head, large soft grip handle, ratcheting mechanism, two Phillips, two flatheads, and two Staries. PZ1, PZ2. Okay, cool. I can go in the bin. Alright, let's have a look. Does that send out? Yep. So, by right... If I need to extend it, I can. Or I can just use it up close. I'm not fitting in. Got a little ball bearing there. Come on, why the hell won't you go back in there? That will. Oh, there we go. The ball bearing is just a little bit stiff. So you got short and stubby. Okay. That actually quite comfortable to hold. Should be a good, good grip to really... I like the fact that you can extend it. That's cool. says you can undo the base and stick other screwdriver bits in here so I use Phillips they actually got a couple of different sizes which is good Good, 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 good. Really good. I like that. Uh, five and six, the flat ends. Uh, which size? Where are they? So we've got Phillips one, size one and two. Which is then two. Then we've got flat heads five and 6.5 mil. I got the PZ1, PZ2. So that's PZ2, which is 
point two, and that is these has got good grip. I know a lot of the times these get loose after a while and they fall out. Um, downside to them. Jesus, I've got some grip. And that is the PZ1, it's got 5.2 on it. Oh, that was supposed to be F2s. Oh, not F2s, S2 or something. Stanley. But that's alright. Let's see. Let's see how she works. I want just normal Phillips. Another good thing is some of my other uh, screwdriver bits will actually fit in here as well, um, like the longer one. Just make sure that fits back in there. Right, where's something we can screw? <laughs> uh, um, I don't think it's going to fit in a key knob. Um, I wouldn't really use that anyway. I normally use electricians, screwdrivers when I'm installing. <coughs> I'm installing knobs. When I'm installing these I always use an electrician screwdriver um, just to protect the finish on these. And because they're a bit skinny and thin, yeah, that won't fit in there. Yeah, that's alright. What about? That works quite well. Let's tighten it up. Actually, quite comfortable. Get a really good grip. Get a really good grip on that. really like this for that price I mean you can't freaking ask for much more really um good control over your screwdriver nice selection of bits I mean it's not overly massive once you finish you put all your screwdriver bits away so they're not falling out everywhere There's something from Bunnings. I'm kind of impressed. Let's move you back down so you can see what's going on. Not too bad. Made in China, of course it is. But for a little ratcheting screwdriver you can set it so you can control both ways for a little stubby it's actually not too bad definitely definitely going to come in handy and I think my longer screwdriver bits which I don't have any in here in the office. 
um, for the longer ones, I can actually fit into that screwdriver as well. Let's have a quick look at my bag. Without my, my camera flying, no. Didn't think I had any. Oh, but that is definitely going to be a handy little bit of kit to throw in my EDC bag. Um, just because the amount of screws I come across that need fix tightening up and removing and stuff like that. So definitely a handy piece of kit to have. Go out to Bunnings, buy yourself one if they've got any on there. Um, they had a few little stubbies and stuff like that, but this one had the best selection of bits that I'm after. Um, any security bits, you can just buy extras and replace them if you come across security bits more often. But a lot of stuff I see is flat and Phillips. So, yeah. Stanley's always been a good brand. Hasn't been too bad a brand. But anyway, there we go. The little stubby fat. I love that ratcheting ability as well. Because your hands get bloody sore trying to turn so ratcheting is a little bit easier um but that no, definitely gonna come in handy small enough compact enough it's gonna fit in the EDC bag and um yeah we'll test her out and see how she goes let's let me go with that vice for a minute flathead I mean like that so that's only single lock so this has single lock either side um Fits in to the cutouts in here. You'll just sit him in there, line him up, turn him. So, it's not too bad. Let's see if we can tighten it. Oh, wow. Well. You get really, really good grip. You get really good positive grip with that and control. I mean, you can get a lot of torque. If need be, you can get a lot of bloody torque out of that tiny little screwdriver. Because of that nice, big, fat grip. Very, very comfortable. Yeah, definitely. Handy piece of kit to get. So, um, yeah. Definitely going to be coming in handy. I'm going to put this now in my EDC bag. Um, so it's good to go. But yeah, let us know. What do you think of the little stubby screwdrivers and scratching screwdrivers? Um, I mean, we all need a screwdriver at some point. Some people's screws are a bit loose. Just need to tighten them up. <laughs> um, so having something that you can hide the bits in here, you're not going to lose all the bits. Uh, I love the ratcheting function. That's definitely going to be helpful. Nice selection of bits for me. Small, compact. Overall, quite a nice little uh, screwdriver. But let us know in the comments. What do you think? Um, yeah, it's not too bad. Small, compact. It'll do the job. So anyway, check out all links in the description. Don't forget to check out the website dalp.com.au. Uh, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell next to it. That way you can stay up to date. As soon as I upload a video, you'll be one of the first to know. Um, put the comments down below what you think. And uh, until next time, cheers, guys. And remember, keep a bloody lead.